got a question for you. Do you remember when Dulux Trade was the dog's doodars? There was nothing else that could touch it. I mean, I am going back quite a while, sort of 80s, 90s. Dulux was premium product. However, I think over the years, and definitely since Axo Nobel has taken over, the, um, the quality of the paint seems to have gone down and down and down. However, if you've used this, that's just come out, the Heritage range from Dulux, it's gone back to the good old days. I've been using this now on a job for the last week, and it is like the, the heyday of Dulux paint. It is beautiful. You can thin it, it rolls lovely. And I was there rolling the wool, and I thought to myself, what is, what is it about this product that, you know, I like? And it was, it's got everything that Dulux used to be. You know, it covers, you can thin it down, it cuts in nicely, it covers really well. You haven't got to worry about tram lines, framing. It's just bulletproof. It is beautiful. So then that got me thinking. Um, do you think that AXO over the years have just dropped the standard of the trade stuff with this in mind so they can bring this in and then sell this as a premium product where in all sort of like anything but name it's like the old recipe the old formulation of, of emulsion it's beautiful now I've been working on a site where a lot of the properties have been sold by the developer but some of them are being still worked on so I um, went and found a couple of decorators and said you know put some of this on on a you know on a little wall see what you think of it and they loved it they thought it was brilliant and they said what is it and I said well you know explain what it was I said it is a little bit is yeah, a little bit is quite it's very expensive but they said it's just like Dulux used to be so that's me two other decorators are thinking the same sort of thing so it may just be us but it seems a little bit you know of a coincidence that three of us think the same thing that you know they're all reasonably sort of well experienced decorators so they did know the old product um they're in their sort of 50s so they, they've been around they've been in the trade a long time but yeah i think axo may have pulled a little bit of a fast one you know and thought well yeah we'll, we'll this is my opinion i don't know but it just seems a little bit because this stuff is amazing it's it's like i say it's what dulux used to be and if you don't believe me, go and buy a litre and give it a go. And I hope, you know, you should be as impressed as I am because it is brilliant stuff. Um, I've got a few pictures I'll show you of, of some work we've done with it. But yeah, it's great stuff. And also, it just makes you realise how crap the trade stuff has become. There are, unfortunately, better products by better manufacturers out there. Um, and I'm, unfortunately, it's sort of, it breaks my heart to say, but Dulux trade is not what it used to be. Uh, but hopefully, with, you know, if this is you know, signs of the future, then maybe they're actually getting wrapped together and putting their socks up. The only, the only unfortunate thing is, like I say, this is very expensive paint. Um, for what used to be a decent trade paint in my opinion so yeah anyway if you've used this put some comments below let me know uh and yeah we we'll, you know it might just be it might just be me thinking oh like you know the good old days if you enjoyed this video then maybe it might be worth checking this video out or even this one take care